Good day, everybody. Tracy Brown here, your snack nutrition, uh, your snack nutrition, uh, your snack nutrition dietitian, and intuitive eating expert. And today, I want to remind you. I'm just going to be a really quick tip on remembering that it's hard to kind of get where you want to go with this process, whether it's binging less, eating more supportively, being more comfortable in the skin you're in. It's hard to do all that when we're doing it from the place of here's a piece of paper and here's some boxes and here's an assignment and you check it off. That's not really what this process is about. It's really about how you can slow yourself down enough, just a space, a little bit enough to be able to notice how you do things. So how you come to the table with your food, how you maybe even um, get your food, how you, um, how you digest, if you digest. Um, if you're eating, are you actually there? Because it's not really fair to yourself if you're eating and then you get mad about the amount you eat, let's say, when the whole time, we're not fully present to what your body is saying about it. If it was satisfying, do you want more or less? Um, what your thoughts are about it and how any of these factors is driving what and uh, the amount you eat. And so again, it's not your fault. I mean, I had to learn this too, that this isn't something this just to get through. I know that we all want to feel better yesterday. Of course we do. We all want to be more comfortable, especially if we're struggling with like chronic illness um, or pain, or you've been at this a long, long time. It's just enough already, right? Nobody wants to struggle or suffer or feel bad any longer than they have to. It's totally normal. It's just that um, when we stay up here from the neck up and we are not enough in the process of what we're doing, what you're gonna find is it's not really that sustainable. When you add another thing into your system, another stressor, another thing to do, all of that, that willpower is going to crumble. And so, this again, just to review, this quick video is about you noticing how you come to the table when you eat, or even if you're binging, how it is you're doing it. You know, what are the factors, where are you at, what's it look like? Um, you know what's been happening before that that may have contributed to it and or, or if you don't binge it's restricting or it's purging like what has in your system or in your mind or in your heart led up to what's happening now this isn't just like oh I just lack willpower this second it's not really about that it's about all the things that have been happening either for a very very long time that have been a buildup or, or that have been there a long long time and we've been avoiding or maybe we've had some ups and downs and there's been a slow build up to like too much and then our system is going to react to that with that with food behaviors or thoughts so I hope this is helpful it's going to be just a really quick tip I do want you to practice this today so please in the comments let me know let's say you practice this now you get off this video and you go say okay I am going to check in with myself and how I'm doing and watch myself, even literally watch myself, how it feels to walk to the table with my food and how it is that I'm making any kind of food choices. Notice what's happening in my body, what I'm thinking about it, if my mind wants to check out and think about what I have to do later today. You know, that's all the factors that are leading up to how I'm behaving with my food. And so really break it down, really slow it down and, you know, know that all of these things if we slow it down enough and they're not optimal for how we want to feel can be adjusted so thank you so much for watching if you're finding that other people you might know could benefit from this let them know about it give them a tag or you know, give them the link or whatever so thank you so much for watching if you have questions please let me know and i will be happy to answer take care and i'll talk to you soon Bye bye